Hello, this is Ami Diamond. In this episode, I'd like to show you a new feature in Microsoft Teams Meeting, and it's called uh, Speaker Coach. So what we'll do is we'll create a new meeting. I'll call the meeting demo, and I'll invite a, a user, which is called Test2. And I will send out the meeting. Then I will join the meeting. And I will uh, just uh, join it like this. And uh, let's see. So uh, under the three dots, you see now we have turn on speaker coach. Now what it will do, it will uh, give me some, you see I get a message here actually, and it tells me that it's on. Uh, now if I speak very, very slowly, it might give me uh, some information that I might speak uh, better. You see, I should try to speak a, a bit low, uh, faster. Now at the end, it, it will actually give me a report that says what recommendations I should do and uh, what should I do. I can, in the three dots, actually um, turn it off. Uh, but let's try to give it another second and I will try and see if there's other things here um, okay so that that's it we can uh, turn off this uh, thing I will get a message that it stopped at any point I can actually stop or restart it and I want now to exit the meeting and let's see uh, where's the report? So I'm back here and I see some message here the speaking coach report only you can uh, visualize it so I see in activities a message and uh, for this date I see I got uh, bad grades let's say for the pace so it says pace can be affected by the audience try um, to set it up Okay, so see, here I see a graph. So actually I have here, this is how much I spoke. This is the suggestions and this is some uh, examples. So um, here also here it says try to avoid uh, filler words. Click each word to see timeline. So this, uh, I don't know exactly what it does, but um, so it's a nice start. It says your speaker coach report is only for you. You see it's private. And if we activate this for the next time we start a meeting, it will automatically uh, be here. So this is good actually, because it can give you a feedback uh, if you're talking too slow or too fast, or if you want to uh, maybe speak in a, happy way or a sad way or, or if you want to get uh, the audience to, to now you see it's actually a tab here um, and unfortunately if I, it's if I look here in the meetings let's say under the chat I this is a meeting but here there's no information actually it's here yep and you see, if I uh, start again, it, 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 it can give me the date and time. But uh, uh, firstly, I, I also got it uh, in the activities. And uh, I'll show you a different uh, example I did. So for instance, here, um, I spoke for one minute, one suggestion. And uh, they told me the pace is uh, too slow. Speed it up a bit. And... Um, Yes, maybe if I had a recording, I could go to exactly this uh, period of time and actually uh, see what's not okay. So as you see here, there's lots of things. Most of the things were okay. And, uh, and it gives some uh, positive feedback. So try it out and uh, let me know. Currently, I'm in uh, public preview. You see this P. Uh, so if you have it, uh, you can mark it. If not, you need to ask your tenant uh, admin to set it up. But you see here, good work. Next time, try to pay attention. And uh, 
That's it. Goodbye.